This article is for fictional characters from the Sonic the Hedgehog franchise that appears exclusively in the animated 90s series Sonic Underground. For characters in other continuities, see List of Sonic the Hedgehog characters. Topic. Agent N Agent N is a robotic, ape-like intelligence operative under Robotnik who was assigned to oversee the production of Robotnik's spy watch robots. He first appeared while Sonic and Manic were busy destroying spy watches and was able to capture them in an energy net. They escaped when Sonya severed the net and caused it to crash into Agent N, who was apparently destroyed. However, he later appeared along with a portable roboticizer and captured Manic, Sonya, Mindy Latour, and Mr. Latour, who were fleeing from the mansion. However, he failed to catch Sonic, who was able to use converted watches to shut him down permanently. Topic: <laughs> Amon Rapi. An ancestor of Queen Alina Hedgehog, Sonic, Sonia, and Manic, Amon Rapi is a sorcerer and prophet. In his own time, Amon Rapi foretold the coming of Dr. Robotnik, and inscribed a blueprint on how to defeat him on a scroll which was placed in his tomb. Later, when Sonic and the others came looking for the scroll, Amon Rapi's mummified minions mistook Sonic for him. The reason for this was revealed as the spirit of Amon Rapi himself appeared, similar in appearance except for an ancient Egyptian outfit, and personality to Sonic. After the Sonic Underground granted his request for a song, he used his spell of immobility to freeze the invading enemies long enough for them to escape. Unfortunately, the scroll was so old that when it was removed from its tube, it crumbled to dust. However, Amon Rapi had left one message, inscribed on the tube was a hieroglyph which translated meant, Hedgehogs will prevail, or as Sonic put it, Hedgehogs rule. Topic. Argus. Argus is Queen Alina's bodyguard who was captured and turned into a robot. When the siblings manage to free him, briefly, from his programming, he shows them where they can meet the Queen. He loses control over his body, but manages to save Sonic, Sonia and Manic from being captured. Topic. Art One of Dr. Robotnik's most powerful creations, Art was developed for the purpose of defeating the Sonic Underground and their Freedom Fighter allies. Able to absorb any technology into his frame to increase in size and power, Art is a learning robot, capable of adapting to anything his opponents might deploy. Art stands for Artificial Robot of Technology. Art was sent to capture the hedgehogs, going through several form changes as he attempted to abduct them. Despite managing to thwart him several times, the trio were caught by Art while rehearsing for a concert. However, Art had heard them play, and requested a song. The group obliged, and Art's free will was activated by the music, even leading him to play a keyboard similar to Sonia's. Art then defected to the Freedom Fighters, using his impressive abilities to free prisoners and destroy SWATBOTs. 
However, he and the hedgehogs were later caught in a crushing chamber. Using his strength, Art blasted a door so that his friends could escape, but he himself was crushed. He also provided inspiration to Manic Hedgehog, who at that time had been feeling as though the efforts against Robotnik were pointless. Topic. Bartleby Sir Bartleby Montclair of Dresden is a posh aristocratic mink and one the richest civilians of Robotropolis. He was Sonia's fiancé. Pompous in every sense of the word, Bartleby loves nothing better than drinking rosebud tea, and himself. Despite these shortcomings he cares deeply for Sonia's welfare, but thinks her brothers are a bad influence on her. Bartleby and Sonic have had to join forces at times, including helping Sonia get to the debutante ball. In Bartleby the Prisoner, Bartleby was announced an enemy to Robotnik and was put on trial as a trap for Sonia. The Sonic Underground helped him escape and he had to go into hiding to escape Robotnik's forces. He shares an uncanny resemblance with Antoine de Coulet from the Sonic the Hedgehog comics and Saddam cartoon. He even shares his personality. Topic: Burlock. Burlock is an elderly vampire bat who is the caretaker of Worst Castle, which is supposedly Sonia's ancestral home. He has a pet owl called Hooter who he is very fond of. He cannot stand loud noises and is very humorous. His catchphrase is, I am Burlock, the castle caretaker. He speaks in the classic vampire accent. Burlock was forced by Sleet who threatened to eat Hooter into helping him set a trap for the Sonic Underground, but after confessing all to the hedgehogs, he helped them escape the collapsing castle through a dimensional mirror. Burlock is actually an agent of Queen Alina, as seen when he acknowledges her presence nearby. He appeared in the episode, A Hedgehog's Home is Her Castle. Topic. Captain Squeege Captain Squeege is a sea sponge who is the captain of the Queen Alina showboat. He runs the resistance cell at Port Mobius, and for a long time was the entirety of the resistance there. He speaks in stereotypical nautical slang. As a sponge, he also has the interesting ability of being able to absorb large amounts of water within his body. When the residents of Port Mobius turned to Robotnik's side so he could protect them from Moby Deep who was sinking ships when it was actually a sub made to look like a sea monster, Squeege was the only one left as being part of the resistance. When the Sonic Underground crashed into, literally, Squeege's showboat, he managed to persuade them to help catch Moby Deep. However, this ended up attracting attention from Sleet, who planned to destroy his ship. Sonic eventually arrived on the ship to help the others destroy the sub and help Squeege bring the rest of Port Mobius back into the resistance. Topic. Chomps. The pet of Knuckles the Echidna, Chomps is a carnivorous dinosaur with a red body and a blue underside. Chomps is the only other known inhabitant of Sonic Underground's floating island, and served Knuckles by devouring intruders who came to the island. 
He wanted to eat sleet and dingo, but after Knuckles released them they ran away, leaving behind a hollow projector with falsified images of Sonic, Sonia, and Manic planning to steal the Chaos Emerald. Chomps ate the projector, causing the images to appear out of his mouth and nostrils. Thanks to this, the hedgehogs were able to determine why Knuckles was attacking them. Chomps only appeared in the episode Friend or Foe. Chomps bears a resemblance to the Biolizard, though Chomps was made long before the idea of the Biolizard was even conceived. Topic. Cyrus. Cyrus is a friend of the Sonic Underground, and one of that continuity's freedom fighters. He is a lion and has a high IQ. He is very similar to Tails as he is a mechanical expert, appears to be intelligent, and can fly vehicles. He is also a great computer hacker and inventor. Cyrus secretly worked for Robotnik to prevent his father from being roboticized, but Robotnik backstabbed him and had his father, Lionel, roboticized. Cyrus betrayed Robotnik and stayed loyal to the Resistance, helping the Hedgehogs in several of their missions. Topic. Dingo. A big, orange creature, probably a dingo. Dingo is the dimwitted partner of bounty hunter Sleet from Sonic Underground. His outward demeanor denotes a tough person but deep inside he is quite soft. Hired by Robotnik to hunt down the royal family, Dingo quickly develops a crush on Sonia, which she often uses to her advantage. Dingo is also very gullible, doing whatever Sleet tells him, and frequently not understanding an insult or parts of a sentence. Dingo's only real usefulness is his odd ability to change shape. When Sleet presses the button on his remote, Dingo can turn into any solid object or life form. Dingo's voice was done by Peter Wilds. Topic. Dubot Dubot is a robotic hairdresser created by Robotnik for gathering intelligence. The robot hypnotizes her patrons into revealing secrets which are then recorded by an internal cassette device. Sleet and Dingo periodically collect the tape and take it back to Robotnik. However the Dubot is unaware that she is aiding Robotnik and has no knowledge of the tape inside her. Topic. Feral Feral was an odd insect-like creature and a major member of Mobotropolis criminal underworld. When Manic was taken by one of Farrell's friends, Farrell accidentally became Manic's foster father and taught the hedgehog everything he knew about thieving. Like the rest of the triplets' guardians, he was roboticized. Topic. If you can If you, can, if you Can is the tribe leader of a desert clan. He has actually been half roboticized and hides his mechanical limbs. Topic. Lady Windemeyer Lady Windemeyer is Sonia's foster mother. She was roboticized. She appears in three episodes, Beginnings, Harmony or Something and Healer.
Luke Periwinkle Luke Periwinkle is from the episode The Hedgehog in an Iron Mask. Where he was forced to lead Sonic and his siblings into a trap. His name is possibly a parody of the actor Luke Perry. Topic: Manic Hedgehog. Manic Hedgehog is the brother of Sonic the Hedgehog and Sonia Hedgehog. He was also raised by thieves. In the series, his instrument involves the drums. He can use his drums to shake the earth and even fire some beams. He also loves kids and surfing. Although Sonic and Manic look a lot alike, his hair is more wild and his fur is green. He likes to steal things and is rather good at it and doesn't like to return what he has found. The only thing he hates more than returning things is Dr. Robotnik. He was brought up by Farrell after one of Farrell's friends found him on the street. Topic: Mantu. Mantu is the son of the chief of the Speedster Island tribe. Topic: Mayor Winaham. Mayor Winaham is a horse who is the mayor of Mobodoon, the Sonic Underground Band's hometown. She was impeached by Sleet, but it is presumed that she has resumed office. Topic <laughs> Max. Max is a pickpocket who leads a small group of thieves. After helping the Sonic Underground, he and his posse are given homes. Topic: <inaudible> Mindy Latour and Mr. Latour. Mindy Latour is Sonia's old friend and a rich fashionist. Her voice, talking and singing, was done by Louise Valence, who also did the singing voice of Sonia. Her father is very protective of her. He was forced to create robotic watches for Robotnik. Topic: <laughs> Moby Deep. Moby Deep is a giant whale mistaken for a sea monster. A parody of Moby Dick. Topic. Oracle of Delphius The Oracle of Delphius is a Mobian prophet, resembling a reptilian anteater. He is one of the Resistance's most powerful allies, perfectly capable of withstanding an attack by numerous enemies. He serves to test Sonic, Sonia and Manic Hedgehog as they struggle to end the war and find their mother. His name is likely derived from the Oracle of Delphi found in Greek mythology. Topic: Queen Sana. Queen Sana is an ancient queen who resembles Sonia. She is not very fast. Topic: Rafi. Rafi is a desert dweller who lives in the city of Tashistan with his mother, father and grandmother. His best friend, Sonia, momentarily loses her memory. He is roboticized in the legs like Bunny Rabbit from Satam. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> 
Renez is the leader of the resistance in Inez. She appears in the episode Sonia's Choice. Topic: <laughs> Sonia Hedgehog. Sonia is the sister of Sonic the Hedgehog and Manic Hedgehog. She is the middle age of the three children, and is the most responsible and level-headed. She takes a lot after her mother, though her fur is far more of a reddish shade. Her hair is a purplish-pink color. Unlike her brothers Sonic and Manic, she was raised by a wealthy family, and as a result, has a somewhat snooty demeanor. Despite being a fugitive, she still takes pleasure in many things that could be called luxuries facials, spas, etc. Her weapon is a keyboard, which is capable of shooting lasers. She appears to have a crush on Knuckles the Echidna. She is voiced by Jaleel White, and he uses his Steve Urkel voice when voicing her. Topic. Sleet A wolf with purple body armor and blue cape, Sleet is cunning, greedy and manipulative. He was once an independent contractor partnered with the idiotic Dingo, but Robotnik persuaded them to work exclusively for him. His task is to hunt down the Sonic Underground Band, Queen Alina, and other freedom fighters. Because of Dingo's incompetence, Sleet often makes him into a scapegoat, and never hesitates to use the strange remote that transforms Dingo into other objects. Despite countless failures, Sleet does on occasion have a successful plan up his sleeve. Sometimes he and Dingo think of plans that make them turn on Robotnik, but these never go well. Sleet's voice was done by Maurice Lamarckie. Topic: <laughs> Speedbot. Speedbot is a roboticized chimera-like robot made up of some of the fastest creatures on Mobius. It is used by Robotnik in a race to capture Sonic, but instead ended up racing Dingo who rammed it into the wall of the track. It then bounced off of it and went flying right on top of Bartleby. Topic. Stripes Stripes is a tiger who lives in Lake Valley. Though he was originally a spy for Robotnik, in the episode The Last Resort, he develops a crush on Sonia and tries to protect her. After Robotnik betrayed him, and tried to destroy the resort, Stripes was almost roboticized, but was rescued by Sonia. He then joined the resistance. <laughs> Titus Titus was a professional conman, pretending to be a scientist who has developed a deroboticizer that can also immunize people against roboticization. He would target the aristocracy and other rich people, conning them into paying for immunization. He was coerced by Robotnik into turning his fake device into a real roboticizer as a trap, suffering an attack of conscience. He pushed Sonia out of it at the last moment and roboticized himself as a result. Topic: <laughs> Trevor Trevor is a mouse who is a friend of the royal siblings and Cyrus. He dresses like a hippie. He is an ace pilot and helps build and fix mechanical equipment. 
However, he can be easily captured and has come close to being roboticized before. He has appeared in several episodes to help the hedgehogs during some of their missions. Topic: <laughs> Uncle Chuck. Uncle Chuck is Sonic's uncle, who was turned into a robot after one of Dr. Robotnik's evil schemes, but retained his normal personality regardless. Topic: Vince. Vince is a black market salesman. Manic sells an orb to him before realizing it is a bomb, but by the time they get there, Vince has sold it to Bartleby. Vince ends up getting roboticized by Sleet. 